Hey friends, this is Atif Ope here. Well, and welcome to the new update on Algorand. On a weekly time frame chart, Algorand is still moving inside this falling wedge pattern. And on the daily time frame chart, it is still moving inside this down channel and bounce on the support of this channel. And in today's video, we will once again take a look at this move. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I am sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then I've also shared the link for the previous month's trading signals report in the video's description. You just need to open that report. And for example, if you would like to check or verify any trading signal, like this is the trade signal for ACM, you just need to click on the link. It will take you to the trading views chart. And there is a play button available on every trading views chart. You just need to click that play button. It will show you how the price and moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. Now, let me do take you uh, to this weekly time frame chart. And for the past several months, I am showing you this a very big falling wedge pattern that is formed here on this weekly time frame chart. And once Algorand will be able to break out this long term resistance of the falling wedge pattern, that can be a big turning point for Algorand. And this downtrend will be changed to the uptrend. We need to break out this downtrend line resistance. You can see that we have several rejections here and here and here as well. And we have several bounces from the support as well. But it is testing the resistance more than the support. Eventually, it can break out. And now, while moving to the downside, it has recently broken down a very, very significant support that we had here at 16 cents. You can see that the previous candlestick is a close below than this support and the new, leaf, uh, new candlestick is open below than this support and now if we take a look at the daily time frame chart then here we have the formation of another down channel and we also have this long uh, this resistance that, that this red line that is the ema 21 on the daily time frame chart that is moving along with the resistance of this down channel so we need to break out these two resistance levels together the ema 21 on the daily time frame chart and also the resistance of this down channel as well recently you can see that after testing the support of this channel the price and it's bound from this support and now there is a probability that it may test the resistance or make another attempt to break out the resistance of this down channel this time the resistance can be here approximately at 16 cents where we have this long-term resistance on the weekly time frame chart as well at 16 cents and previously we can see this level has been breaking as a support here and if we move more back then here back in uh, September 2019, it was breaking as a support, and here for a while it worked as a resistance. Therefore, once the price and will be able to break out this resistance level, then it can once again flip into a very strong support and long term support for the price line. However, we need to break out this channel and also this uh, resistance of the falling wedge pattern. After breaking out the resistance of this channel, the target can be here at the top of the channel that will be approximately at 19.5 cents. And if the price and reaches at 19.5 cents, then it can reach the resistance of this bigger falling wedge pattern as well. And once it will be able to break out this long-term resistance of the falling wedge pattern, then the long-term target for this huge breakout will be here at the top of the wedge that can be between $2.50 to $3. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.